Pollution, piles of trash, and now a fight in the streets. A mobile home park is in turmoil tonight, and neighbors say the atmosphere there is becoming toxic. This story comes out of Iowa City. An ongoing argument between neighbors flew out of control at the Regency Trailer Court on Oak Crest Hill Road. Take a look. There was pushing, shoving, no, and swearing last night. No, These two women even tonight. fell to the ground, yes. and our crews eventually had to break it up. You can see it's not over here. She comes back for more and it's on. Got nasty and tonight CBS 2's Lindsay Marone went out there to get to the bottom of what's happening at that trailer park. Lindsay? Jack, as you can imagine, for something like this to happen, emotions really had to be running high out at Regency Mobile Home Park. And while it may be hard to take your eyes away from something like this, you really need to in order to see the bigger problem here, a problem in the mobile home park that affects more than just these two really angry women. Regency Mobile Home Park's problems are visible even when a hand covers our camera lens. Go! Folks say their neighborhood is now run down. They're taking our pool away. They've taken away our community center. And just past this gate is the park's water treatment plant that the DNR says is not up to par. All the problems piling up are oh, causing tempers to flare. He hear this for me. Looking for someone to blame. This is what you see right when you enter the neighborhood, an old moldy trailer, trashed, torn down, and left. There are homes like this all over the park. Those had to come down before kids got hurt. The woman here fighting in yellow is Nicole Seaman. She lives here, and her company is responsible for removing this mess. Do you feel bad that, that it came down to that fight? No, I don't. Honestly, part of living in a trailer court, you know, it's... Weird ways to meet your neighbors, but you know. And this was how Seaman and her neighbor Daisy were introduced. Hey guys, come on, come on. Oh hey guys. <laughs> Daisy doesn't think the homes are being cleaned up fast enough. Just listen to the prelude to the brawl. Tell them to come down here, make the <laughs> rain Get stop, the and you snap your <laughs> finger, sweetheart, because the is not the getting paper. done until it stops raining. See, I don't have it won't to get done anyway. To you. It won't get done anyway. A day later, Siemens crews are back to work. She says they can only work as fast as the weather allows. Everybody can be mad about that. It's, it's just the way it goes. While this fight is over, Siemens says the mess of the mobile home debris probably will not be entirely cleaned up until the end of next week. As for the other problems in the park, like the lack of pool and the bad water, the park's been without a manager for weeks and just got a new manager today, though we were only able to speak with her for a few seconds before she kicked us off the property. In the studio, Lindsay Marone, CBS 2 News. Lindsay, thanks a lot. All that new Regency Mobile Home Park manager would say is that the issues are being addressed. When asked when the problems will be fixed, she said she had no comment.